Tonight's top story, another effort by Morgan Geyser to win her release from a state run mental health facility. A lot of you probably know her story and her involvement with Anissa Wire in the so called Slender Man stabbing back in 2012. The two girls claim they stabbed another young girl to please a fictional internet character known as Slender Man. A motion hearing for Morgan Geyser began in Waukesha this afternoon, and CBS 58's Taj Mahal joins us live outside Waukesha County Courthouse to tell us what happened today. Day. Tajma. We heard from two doctors today. Both have spent time with Geyser and conducted psychological evaluations. Both of those doctors shared in court today on the record that they do not believe she is ready for release at this time. Now, Geyser, now 21 years old, appeared in court today as each doctor took the stand and shared their observations of her mental well being. She was 12 years old at the time of the crime and has been kept in a mental health facility since 2014. Much of her time there was discussed in court today, including a history of schizophrenia and other psychological disorders. Concerns were discussed about Geyser's readiness to return to the community, and doctors shared that there are still several factors at play impacting that readiness. It is my opinion that she continues to pose a significant risk of bodily harm to self, others, or property. Um, so in other words, I am not in support of her petition for conditional release at this point. And tomorrow we will hear from a third doctor and her attorneys will also get the chance to ask questions as well before the judge makes a decision about that potential release. Now, if she is granted conditional release, a formal release plan will need to be submitted to the court before a release date can be given out. For now, reporting live in Waukesha, I'm Taj Mahal, CBS 58 News.